everyone, it's Cal from Cal's Crafts. Welcome back and hi if it's your first time. I've got a little parcel today which I thought I'd share with you. I've been waiting, when did I order this? I think it was, I've been waiting too long to be fair. 17th of June I ordered this. So roughly I suppose a month. Is that a month? Just getting the date up on there, yeah. Yeah, so roughly a month, four weeks. So I don't think that's bad because this came from America. And this came from an Etsy store and um, called Whimsical Daisies. Rachel had shown some of this, Rachel Ray. And I thought, oh, I'd like to try that. And it's called Notches Mama's Mud. Something like that. Notches. I'm sure it's Mama's Mud anyway. Um, and I wanted to try some. So that's easy. So we've got one, two, three, four to try. I think they were about three pounds, four pounds something each. I think it depended on the weight. Of, um, I think if you had the smaller one, it was three pounds if you had the larger one it was more but I wanted to try and also on on her shop um it does say it doesn't doesn't send to the United Kingdom but as Rachel said to email her and ask her so I did and she very graciously said yeah that's fine as long as you don't mind paying the postage which was about 12 pounds something she said I'll send it to you I said great and I said but I haven't seen anything really that I like because there was only I think one or two of the muds on her Etsy site and she said well what flavours are you looking for so me being me reeled off what I liked so she said right I'll see if what I can do and what I can't do and she came back with all four that I liked oh <gasps> you get that one you get that one on then they're very cold you're very cold and this one is through the woods Oh, and it does smell that. Go on, have a have a big snifter now. Go on, go on. Oh, that's lovely. Oh, that's really fresh outdoor smell. And that does remind me where you could smell all the pines and everything. So we've got that one. Then this one. Oh, I like opening parcels, don't you? <laughs> it's so exciting. Just chilling. We've got a cat ear in there. Cat ear or dog ear. Not that I mind because I've got a cat and a dog, so and they get everywhere. This is cocoa nut just chilling. So I like cocoa. Oh, that's divine. Oh, I like the fact that she's got little different. Oh, look, she's got different shapes. Just notice that one's like a pear shaped. Let me see. And then that one's a star shape. Oh yes, coconut, oh, and it's not overpowering because some coconut smells. You open it and it's like, whoa, that just hit me for six. But this one is really, really nice. And then this one, I like the fact that they're all different colours as well. It says, hello. This is lavender dreams. This is the one that I specifically wanted to see if she could do because I love the. The smell of lavender. I've got lavender flowers. I've cut off my lavender plant in here because I absolutely love the smell of lavender. I just, oh, it's so subtle. It's they're not, they're not over. They're not as strong as um, paddy wax in scent. They're not, no, uh, they're not as strong as smell as that. But oh, it's nice. It's a nice smell. So if you wanted a strong smell. No, it's not overpowering. Well, not paddy wax is not overpowering. It's just very strong smell and I like it. But I like this. And this one, it's coffee time. I mean, if it's got coffee, you're going to want it, aren't you? Oh, I love a little heart sticker. I just like the way she puts a little something on the top. Oh, gosh, yes. You know when you open a bag of coffee? And you get that hit of coffee. That's what that reminds me of. 
that's probably that's probably the strongest out of the three but I like that so we have it's coffee time and I think let me see if I've got my I don't know if I had mine I think let me see if I can get my order form up I think she had to do a special one for me I don't think it comes up yeah the 331 for a five gram And the seven gram was four fifty six. So I think I went for the five gram because I wanted to test them first. But there's plenty in there that is going to last you. Look, can you see? Hang on, like that. Can you see? So these are going to last you a long time. So I thought, seeing as I've got them out, that we would try it. So I've got me nice new. Can you see them? Me turtle. Totally awesome. So if you go back one of my videos, it tells you where. Well, I can tell you now. I got this from the Badge Shack UK on Etsy. She also does Facebook as well. And these are only a couple of quid. But I like that for fox sake. <laughs> Just tickles me. I know. So I thought, right. So what I'm going to do, you're going to see me clean out a pen. So I've got my red one. And I always click it. I've got um, a needle. And I'm going to clean up the paddy wax that was in here. And I always have a tray like this with my scrap bits of waxes that I use as well. So we're going to scrape all this out. And yes, you will hear, will hear people coming up and down and in and out. And That was Jessie, if you heard that swearing. That bloody hell was it? Somebody, she's got, they're playing on something. So they obviously wanted something from downstairs. So, is that everything out? Make sure I've got it all out. I find a needle is the best thing to clean them. Because you can get right down. Into the nitty gritty as they say. I'll see some there. There it is. I knew there was a piece in there. Right. Yep. You see? Then <laughs> how I expect you to see down there. I have no idea. So yeah. So I don't think I'll try the three placer because I'm not very good at the three placer anyway. But what should we try? Should we try? It's coffee time. Lavender dreams through the woods, or coconut. Should we just mix them up and drop them? What is it? It's coffee time. So we've got coffee time. Do you want another snifter? Do you? Do you? Go on, go on. Dare you, dare you. Have another snifter. <sighs> that is lovely. So I think with this one, we just scrape it in. So that's what I'm going to do. I suppose you could push it into onto the side. And then scrape it and fill it up that way. I'm just taking it off camera to see if it's full. I could do it a bit more. So I'm hoping the opticians is going to come open soon so I can see about getting different glasses again. I know I haven't had these ones long, but right. I think that's full. What do you think? Does it look full? So what I tend to do when I first... Do, I do it with paddy wax. I've never done this one. Is I get my old drills that are in there and I just push down on one and then I find that the overflow can you see it a little bit around the edge comes off then hopefully if I haven't squashed it all out it'll pick up a drill so let me see if I so we're going to experiment because I have no idea because I am very very heavy handed with putting drills down so picking them up beautiful got to say don't know how long it lasts I suppose I would say it's probably the same as the paddy wax in the sense that if you press too hard then you're going to leave residue on your drills if you're gentle you don't now I start off gentle and then 
as I get into it I can start or I daydream because I don't know if anybody else does that but you switch off don't you when you're diamond painting and my mind completely switches off and I go into a zone and that's when probably the heavy handedness starts coming in then but I like that noise listen you hear that I like the noise you probably hear my tap dripping as well I've got a constant drip on my tra tap at the moment I'm liking this What do you think? Yeah? So we see about the three places. So I'm just like curiosity now. What I might do is just press this in to the, that mud. I know you're supposed to scrape it on, but hey ho. We're experimenting together, aren't we? No. Is this bit there? See, that's why I like a needle, gets all the last bits off. Right, let's have a go. Anything else, I don't want to break that, break that heart. No, that didn't work, did it? I think we are going to have to scrape it in. So that probably be your different, why you can't use it. Oh, that worked. Oh, that worked. Scraped it up the side like that. Go a bit there. It's in there though, isn't it? Right, better shake some threes. Now I'm absolutely crap at using a three place, a four place, or anything above. I just about manage my um, single placer. Oh well, works perfect. Can't fault that. And that was easy to put in the three pacer once I sussed it. I'm liking that. I do like this. A lot. So Beth from, as I say, Winds Called Daisy for people that are in Britain. She was brilliant. And I do, if you see something and they say don't ship to to Britain, just give them a little little email. They've got a contact button on it, see, especially, and ask them. If, as long as you don't mind paying, it does cost about 11 to £12 pound postage from America. But I, I take this as a treat, something I wouldn't normally, I wouldn't, wouldn't normally buy or can't get in this country I didn't pay any customs on this now that's one thing you have got to take into account if it's over 15 pound you do have to pay a fee a VAT fee I think it is and customs and if it's over I can't remember the other one is it 39 pound gift or something you have to pay some but um and that's hit and miss. Sometimes I pay it, sometimes I don't. I got one from Mislaid Pages, Jesse. I had to pay customs, but I knew I'd be paying customs on that one. And I was prepared to pay customs on that one because I really wanted it, which I will be showing you tomorrow on my floss tube. I, will, I haven't opened it. I've been really good. I'm going to open it with you lot. But I thought I'd do this one. I can't get over how good this stuff is. It's lovely. And it was so easy to put in that. Have we got a bigger one? I've got a four placer. Shall we see if we can get it in the four placer? We'll just try. And it does the same. Like that's a four placer. And you can see the indentations. And you've got the indentations of the top of the squares there. But let me. Oh, shall I show you? They're not. This flip four placer is on its way out because it's got the. I'll show you if you can see. This is Millie's, by the way, that I have had a go at. But I don't know if you can see the little ridges. 
Can you see them where the diamonds have been pushed in and you've got like the little bumps now of where it is. So let's have another go. So I did it one side first. Oh, you can't see, sorry. So I've got one in one side and then I'm just, it's a bit messy. And then I just scraped it in and you can see, I don't know if you can see. I don't know if you can, I have to show you that it's, you can see it there, that it's in there. Just give it a press down or press it down on your, your desk. Now I've not used a four pieces, so this could be, have we got anywhere to put four yet? We've got some over there. This could be disastrous. All right, can you see me picking them up or not? All right, ooh, yes, picked up four. And she placed four, not very even, but hey ho, that doesn't matter. I placed them, picked up four, placed them. So, oh, I picked up five then, never mind. One extra for free. Like buy four, get one free, isn't it? And then just slide them across. So where's my one? So let's have another go with a single placer. I'm making this. And this is soft. It's um, more like your consistency of the pink wax compared to the hard wax of, of the paddy wax. Just trying to give you a comparison. I love my paddy wax mind. But I have to say, if you want to mix and match, I like this one as well. So there you go. If you like the idea of these, as I said, showed you, you can use them with the singles or the multi places. I think it'd probably be a bit more difficult on any bigger place because, I mean, Millie uses one of these. You'd probably find that hard to get that in there to scrape it. But as for the three placer and the four placer, it worked perfectly doing it that way. It's a little bit messy in your, in your thing, as long as you don't mind a little bit of a scrapey roo there. Oh, and it smells divine. Oh, coffee cup. I'm going to have to make a coffee now. I've just had tea. Well, I did have I've still got half a cup of tea, but I might throw that and make coffee now. So there you go, guys. Just thought I'd show you what Whimsical Daisy's product looked like and how it worked. On my canvas with the squares and i would say it probably exactly the same with the circles so thanks for stopping by and having a look i really appreciate it if you want to stick around if you're not press the old subscribe button please do it's just below this video just down there and by the side there's a little ding ling ling bell to let you know when i go live which is on a sunday and when i upload videos but most importantly thank you for coming please take care and please stay safe Love you all. Bye.